What is up, guys? Welcome back to 86 Ambrosia. It's your girl, Jen. That's with one J and two N's, and this is my YouTube channel. If you're new here and this is your first time ever clicking on a Walmart try on haul by your girl, Jen, welcome and thank you so very much for clicking on that thumbnail that brought you into this pre-fall haul featuring Walmart. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Let's get into it. Let's fly you away, just you and me. Need a little break from the city. It's been so long since we've been gone. Now, if you've been rocking out with your girl Jenny, you know I am a lover of Walmart. You know I love all things Walmart fashion because Walmart has truly become a fashion destination. And so when they started dropping their fall pieces, I had to go ahead and get mine had to get mine before they're all gone because of course I love visualizing my higher self showing up as the woman I so desire to be, but I like to do it very affordably. Okay, let's get into this first look. So if you have been rocking out with your girl Jen, then this first top that I have on, I actually featured it over the summer. This is a gorgeous one shoulder double line top that is by the brand Scoop. And I love it because I think that it pairs so nicely against my tan skin. Again, it just looks so very good, so very regal. And then I put it on with this gorgeous faux leather skirt that I just got that is a part of the fall launch from the brand Scoop. Now over the summer, your girl Jen has been bodying this body. I have been slimming down. I have been eating right. I have been working out. I have been training and it has really paid off so much so that I'm actually going to have to send this skirt back and get a size small. This skirt that I have on is a size medium and I know right now it doesn't look like it's too big and that is because I did put on my Celine Triomphe team belt. It's a very slim belt, luxury belt. I love it. I think it looks really, really good with this skirt actually, but that wasn't how I was planning on styling this look. I'm having to do that because if I take the belt off, the skirt actually slides down. And that's a good thing, baby. To go from a large to a medium, baby, to have to wear a small, yes, ma'am, I'll take it. I'll take it. I actually still have the tag on in the back because again, I will be sending this skirt back to get a smaller size. But other than that, this skirt is perfection. So before I show you the next look that I got from Walmart, I do want to say that if you're not subscribed or you don't have the bell on, go ahead and make sure you do that. I have a huge Walmart sponsored fall haul coming up and I'm going to be sharing with you how I'm taking my looks and turning them into business casual styles because not only do I want to be my highest self when I'm running the streets, but I also want to be my highest self when I show up at my workplace every day. You know what I mean? I want if you like extreme makeover content, you will enjoy this classroom makeup and makeover vlog that I just dropped last week. Girl, it shows you how I'm transforming this old, ugly classroom at my new school into something so nice for the students to enjoy. I promise you, you will really enjoy this one, and I'll leave it down in the description box. So this next dress that I have on here, also coming out of Walmart, by the brand Scoop, it is so sexy. And then I love that it has this lace detailing to it because I feel like that really does lend in the styling of the dress. Now I will say, and this is cut a whole lot lower than I thought it would be. Um, I did not imagine that this V would be this deep. I am on the bustier side. That does not bother me, but if you're someone who's saying, I don't like that much cleavage out, that's a little bit too much for my taste. One alternative, if you really, really like the dress, you can always use double-sided tape in order to seal up this V or close up this V a lot more to your desired level of comfortness as far as a plunging neckline dress is concerned. Cause baby, this dress is definitely plunging. Baby, she plunging down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 she's plunging down. And I have big girls, like I have a 34 double Ds. And so I can understand if you're saying, yeah, that's cut a little low, Jen, that's, that's a little low. So this twill vest by Sofia Vergara from Walmart, or excuse me, Sofia Vergara jeans is so stinking cute. Oh my goodness, I love it. 
First of all, you know that I love the color green. I just said that with the last piece. So when I saw this little vest that looks almost as if it's denim, but it's not, it's very, very soft. Um, I just had to pick it up. A look like this that is very comfortable, yet I'm being very intentional with how I'm styling myself gives me both a sense of class and sophistication, but it's more on the relaxed, very, very casual side of things. If I wanted to dress this up and make this a little bit more business casual, I would just put on like a bodysuit, like a white long sleeve square neck bodysuit underneath, and I would probably pair it with a really cute skirt, and I would be good to go. This look would eat no matter if I'm dressing her up or if I'm dressing her down. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And of course, I had to grab my mother jeans. You guys know if you've been rocking with me that my mother jeans from Anthropology. I invested in these jeans. These jeans were not cheap, but I just think that they fit me so super nicely. So any top that I'm getting out of Walmart and I want to be very casual, the first thing I think is, can I pair it with my mother jeans? And of course, this look does just that. Now to jazz this look up, I did grab my Brandon Blackwood Kendrick Toe. It's in a green denim. You know Brandon Blackwood is one of my favorite designers of accessories especially bags. I have so, so many bags from Brandon Blackwood. And I think that this green tote pairs again quite nicely with this look, although it's a different shade of green when you're comparing it to the vest. And again, it just shows that you can be intentional even when you're not like dressing up, dressing up, or even if you're not going to work, you can still be very intentional with your look with just some jeans and a cute vest. Yes, yes. Okay, so I think that I have found the piece from this Walmart haul that is my favorite. Everything I've put on has been so super fabulous and just fantastic. But this cargo skirt here, this black denim cargo skirt is hands down probably my favorite piece from this try on haul. First of all, I love it because although I'm wearing it in a very casual manner because I'm about to actually leave out, go on a little date day, um, and I wanted to have like this whole cropped denim top on so I can do a little denim on denim. And then I love that it just shows you like little peaks of my waist. Um, I can actually wear this skirt to work and make it business casual simply because the split in the front of the skirt is not too high. It's perfect. It comes right up to my knee. The skirt is long. It comes down pretty much to my feet. So there is a lot of versatility in this utility skirt. There's a lot of versatility in this utility skirt. Yes, ma'am. I love it. Yes. This is hands down my favorite piece from this trial on haul because I can just imagine how I can wear this with flats, how I can wear this skirt with boots, how I can wear this with a sneaker and I will be giving the girls the business every single time. But how I styled it today in this moment right now, I have on this denim vest. It does zip up in the back. I got this from Shein. I love it because I love to do a little denim on denim. Plus this is a dark wash denim paired with this black denim skirt. Scoop, you did your thing with this number here. Now I did get her in a size 10 um, and I'm glad I did. It allows the pockets to lay flat. You know that it's a cargo skirt without having like that bunching sensation on the sides of the skirt. And then I paired this look, ooh wee, with my new red shoes that I did get from Dillard's. This is like a little kitten heel. It's so cute. She's so comfortable. She's so dainty. She's so feminine. And this look is complete. So once again, I have put on another green number and she's a smash. She, uh, She's a smash. And I'm like at a loss for words because when I put that cargo skirt on just a moment ago, I just knew that that was the skirt that I was like, yeah, that's my favorite piece. But then when I put on this please say dress here, it looks so good. Wow. Okay, so of course this dress is coming out of Walmart. Um, it is by the brand Scoop. And this dress does come with a belt. Um, that's the same color, same material. But I virtually never wear the belts that come with dress 
dresses, I always take them off and add my own belt or add a belt bag because I just love the contrasting look. So of course I went back and grabbed my Celine because it's a thin belt. Surprisingly, I'm gonna also have to get another notch added to her because now she's a little bit too big. So it's like the catch 2020 when you're losing weight. Um, you feel good, you look good, you love how you look in your clothing, but then you realize that things that you have invested in or when you're shopping, you have to be um, a lot more intentional about your sizing because your sizing is constantly changing. But nevertheless, this dress says fall to me. I picked her out. I said that I would like to be able to have a really nice regal number. And I love this sort of high-low detailing that I find in this dress because like it's an uneven hem at the bottom. I don't think I would have ever picked out a dress like this because of the hemline at the bottom, but it is that feature that just makes this dress that much more gorgeous in my most humble opinion. And once again, I feel like I've styled myself to perfection. I left no crumbs on the table when I picked out these clothes from Walmart. I exceeded, as I always do, my own expectations for my own personal styling, and I am indeed in love. This dress is so cute. It's one of the best ones that I've owned that I've purchased from Walmart, and I cannot wait to wear her because she is comfortable and she does usher fall right into the mix. But this dress here, yes ma'am, this dress is a 10 out of 10 on a 10 out of 10 scale. She don't get no better than this so right just here. Like that we've reached the end of this Walmart try on haul. All of the links will be down in the description box. And I thank you so very much for catching this particular try on. Until I see you in my next vlog or video, I will see you in my next vlog or video. Bye guys.